Shalom, all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakah HaKodash. Double honors to my elder apostles and my elders. A great millstone, all right, uh, which is something that you see here on the screen, all right. Um, peace and blessings to the elect, all right. This is the brother Atazari from GMS Houston, all right. And I was watching a live day of atonement camp, all right, from 9 16 21, with the uh, elder apostle recording other elders, all right. And um, I had just did a lesson, by the way, I want to put out there that I do have another page, uh, uh, GMS Future King, okay. And this is Future King uh, GM, GMS, all right? But um, I'll be loading uh, videos to my other page. But uh, this one I'm going to put on the uh, Future King GMS, all right? And this one is dealing with mercy. And that's where they started off because I did another lesson, you know, speaking about the brotherhood on the other page. But this one, this... Uh, when they started off, they were going into mercy with the first thing they was going into, man. All right. And um, I wanted to do a lesson over being merciful because we know what the scriptures say, which I'm going to bring out the scriptures. But mercy is a very serious thing. And we definitely need mercy. We all need mercy. We all need it. Now, there is a thing as being over merciful when somebody is clearly off then you know judgment has to be exercised but when we when it comes to this brotherhood man you know you got to be real careful okay you know make sure that you're showing mercy towards one another because the merciful are going to receive mercy but you're going to get that scripture okay now of course we correct one another we rebuke we reprove you know and at the end of the day, we have to keep in mind, we still brothers and we all pushing this word. Unless Jake is just like going off on the doctrine, man, and doing things. Then, you know, something got to be done about that, you know. But uh, we, we should, you know, constantly mercy should always be right there. All right. Now, I want to go to the scriptures. All right, let me start off in the book of uh, St. Matthew. All right, we'll get there first. Five and five or five and six. Seven. This is St. Matthew five and seven. It says, blessed are the merciful. You see, blessed. All right, not cursed are the merciful. Blessed are the merciful. All right. And sometimes Jake make you so piss you just want to grab jake around the throat sometime man and just shake the hell out of him like what the hell is wrong with you you know but exercise mercy because think about how how we went off we didn't done things worthy of debt but yet the most high had mercy matter of fact let me get another scripture before i go on which again is whew, man when i first read this scripture I really said it and meditated on it, said it. I really sat and meditated on it for a while, man. Because you got to really sit and think. I'm going to bring it out. This is uh, Sirach. And the brother's probably like, yeah, I bring that out all the time. Yes. This is Sirach 2 and 18 saying, We will fall into the hands of the Lord and not into the hands of men. For as his majesty is, the Lord's majesty, Yahweh Yahweh's majesty. And you just think about that. The grandeur of the Lord's majesty. His majesty, man. Just think about that. And just let that really set in. It says, For as his majesty, Salakia, for as his majesty is, so is his mercy. You see? So is his mercy. Okay, and whew, we need that mercy, big time. I got a precept rope right here. Let me see what that say. Yep, let me bring this out also, and then we'll get 
get some more scriptures. This is uh, Sirach 16 and 12. It says, as his mercy is great. You see? See? The Lord's mercy is great. Look at the mercy he had on King David. And I could really stop right there. King David, a prophet, wrote these, these psalms. These, the psalm I'm going to bring out is a psalm of David. Okay? Um, Sirach 16 and uh, 12. As his mercy is great, so is his correction also. Okay? He judged a man according to his works. Okay, let me put this out there. Let the scripture say, The elect are going to be pardoned for all their iniquities. Meaning, the word pardon means to make it as though it never happened. Now, just as we exercise mercy, yes, we do have to exercise judgment. Okay, you can't be over merciful. Okay, we, we can't be over merciful, but just speaking about the grandeur of the Lord's mercy, okay, and how we've all received that same mercy, and we have to keep that in mind when we're dealing with one another, and I'm talking about the brotherhood, okay, and, 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 and men, you know, that may be woke up to this truth that just might, might not be on the level that we're on. Okay, we have to constantly keep that in mind and have mercy. All right, um, let me do this. Okay, um, let me see what verse it was. It was one more verse I wanted to get out of that Sirach, I believe. No. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me jump. Let me get verse fourteen. It says, "Make way for every work of mercy, for every man shall find according to his works." Okay. So, and at the same time, the balance to that is, as us, you know, don't be doing stuff, and oh, well, brother, gonna be exercise mercy. No, because we're gonna be judged judged according to our works. So make way for mercy. Okay, meaning do things to receive it. Okay, do your best to receive. We should do our best to receive mercy also. Okay, now let me get uh the book of Psalms. No, 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 I'm sorry. Back in St. Matthew 5 and uh, uh, 7. Blessed are the merciful. Blessed means opposite of a curse. Blessed are the merciful, for they shall obtain. Let me get the word obtain. L M N O P O. I O L M N L Q R S T. Okay, obtain. S T ob. Obtain, to come into possession of, get or acquire, procure, as through an effort or by a request. Hey, we ask the Most High for mercy, don't we? We should be. I know I do, man. Constantly, for the Most High to have mercy on me. Now I ain't got to go into detail. Ain't none of us got to go into detail. Now, in prayer, you, you know, have mercy on me for the, my past transgressions. Okay? And, the, you know, then and now. All right? That between, that's between you and the, that's between us and the Most High. We all need to obtain mercy. So, blessed are the merciful, for they shall obtain mercy. Uh, as through an effort or by request, asking the Most High 
for mercy. We request mercy from the Most High to obtain or reach to be prevalent, customary, or in vogue. Uh, so the synonyms are gain, achieve, earn, win. Win it. Ain't we racing? We want to win mercy too. Because we need the mercy of the Lord to be saved. We need him to have mercy on us. Okay, y'all done took a, a good enough licking. That's enough. Like on that movie, uh, Life. When they was fighting over the cornbread. And then the, the head dude came and he was like, that's enough. He done took a, took a good enough beating with old Eddie Murphy and the big bald head dude. You know, the old Jake, I guess he was, you know, he had been there the longest in the, in the prison. You know, he had seniority. You know how the jailhouse worked with Jake. You know, uh, he like, yeah, that's enough. He done had enough. When he could have just sat back and let the dude just beat him to death. But mercy was shown. That's an example. All right, we asking the Most High, have mercy on us. You know, we need that mercy. We done took a, a, a good enough licking. All right, uh, gain, achieve. So when you gain something, you have to then put in work to get it again. So rock, uh, oh, I, I switched. Uh, where was it? Salakia fourteen and four six. Uh, Sarap sixteen and fourteen. Make way for every work of mercy. Do what you got to to obtain it. For every man shall find according to his work. All right. So let me get another scripture. All right. Let's go to the book of um, Psalms. I believe it's. Let me see. I got it in my scriptures. Forty one. Yes. All right. Let me go to Psalms. 41. 41. We're going to start at verse 1. To the chief musician, a Psalm of David. All right. So let me read the heading in my scriptures also. This is Psalms 41. The heading say, Blessing of the charitable man. All right. To the chief musician, the Psalm of David. All right, Psalm 41 and 1. All right, now see, that was in those, uh, is that parentheses? I think, I can't remember. You know, I haven't dealt with those terms since school. I've been out of school longer than a lot of brothers been alive. I believe it's in parentheses, I don't know. Uh, but where it say to the chief musician that's in them, them little brackets or whatever, to the chief musician, a Psalm of David, all right, that's written in the hidden inside of my scripture, all right, so Psalms 41 and 1, blessed is he that considereth the poor, all right, the Lord, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, will deliver him in time of trouble, or in the day of evil, as it says in my uh, margin. You see, and we're coming into the greatest time of trouble, Jacob's trouble. We in the time, man, and we're going to need all the mercy we can get. That all had like a bunch of L's at the end, right? We need mucho mercy. Uh, Verse 2, the Lord Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai will preserve him. You know what preserves is? Keep them. Okay? Like when you make preserves. Uh, uh, well, brothers may not be familiar with that, but I grew up on the farm and we had preserves. Meaning we'd harvest stuff and then we'd, you know, preserve it so it could last till the winter time or through the winter or, or the hell, even into the next year. We had preserves for years. You know? Preserve. Psalms 41 and 2, the Lord will preserve him and keep him alive. Hey, and that's what we hoping, huh? And he shall be blessed upon the earth. And that's another thing we're hoping for. 
and thou wilt not deliver him unto the will of his enemies. We know who our enemies are. Psalms 83, starting with our arch enemy, Edom. Exercise mercy. Don't be merciful, merciless. Okay? When it comes to our brothers. You know we're not going to always get along. Shit. It just is what it is. Brothers fight. Alright? I grew up with two brothers. They constantly was fighting. I got into it with them too. You know? But they was older than me and bigger. You know, I was just a little fella. But at the end of the day, they still stuck up for me, you know, out there in the world. Okay? Uh, let's continue. Okay? Let me put that right there. Uh, Psalms 41 and 3. The Lord will, matter of fact, let me read 2 again. The Lord will preserve him and keep him alive, and he shall be blessed upon the earth, and thou will not deliver him unto the hand of so like it, and thou will not deliver him in him unto the will of his enemies. What's the wills of our the will of our enemies? Death and destruction. Alright. Uh we want to be delivered into the Lord's hands. Okay? Like I read in the book of Sirach. Two was it two and eighteen? Uh we will fall into the hands of the Lord. Okay, we don't want to fall into the hands of our enemies, okay, because we know what the our enemies are all about. Uh, St. John 8 and 44, you're your father the devil, and the lust of your father you will do. What what are his, what, what, what do the devil lust after? He's a liar, he's a murderer, he's a thief, okay, um, Verse 3, Psalms 41 and 3. Let me see if it's on. Okay, yeah, yeah. Psalms 41 and 3. The Lord Yahabashim Yahabashah will strengthen him upon the bed of languishing that will make all his bed in his sickness. All right. Uh, let me see what that say in the margin. Uh, or give thanks. Okay. The Lord will strengthen him upon the bed of languishing. All right, hey, we all languishing, okay? That will make all his bed in his sickness. I said, Lord, this is King David, be merciful unto me. I could stop right there. Because this is one of the things we pray. When we pray, Lord, be, have mercy on me. Shit, just from the shit I done done today. I said, Lord, be merciful unto me. Heal my soul, for I have sinned against thee. Uh, let me read that again. I said, Lord, Yahweh, Yahweh, be merciful unto me. Heal my soul. All our souls need he needed healing. And and then uh, continual, you know. For I have sinned against thee, against ye, against our power. We all have, so we all need what mercy, mercy. Um. I'm just reading ahead. See if I'm gonna bring out some more. And that whole chapter is fire. I'm going to end it right there. Lord willing, this was edifying. And again, I got another page of GMS Future King. Uh, for anybody that may be listening and ain't subscribed, please subscribe. You know, because I don't know how much longer this page is even going to be up, man. You know, they going back, way back. And striking videos from years ago, man. And it's all leading up to what's prophesied. A famine of the word. Which, bring it, man. Shut YouTube. Get us off of YouTube. Just get us off the internet. 
Make it to where we can't go out and speak no more too, Esau. What are you dragging your knuckles for, you cave beast? Come on with it, man. Because we hasten to, we ready to get the hell out of here. We ready to get the hell out of hell, man. Okay? Again, Lord willing, this was edifying. Please subscribe to my other page. Kahalau Yahu Bashim Yahu Shai Bashom Rahakodash. Double honors to my elder apostles and my elders at Great Millstone GMS. Peace and blessings to the elect. Shalom.